Students, now that you are aware of various types of tenses, we will be focusing on present tense in detail. Present tense is used to express a habitual action, a general truth, a future action that has a fixed schedule, a permanent situation, a feeling or thought. A habitual action. What do we understand by this? Let's look at this example. I walk to school every day. Here, I walk explains a habitual action, a general truth. The example, the earth revolves around the sun. Now, the, the earth revolving around the sun is a general truth. A future action that has a fixed schedule. The example makes it very clear. The mayor leaves for Delhi tomorrow. Agra is on the banks of river Yamuna. Here, this is explaining a permanent situation. Jo feels she will not be selected for the school drama. Here, feeling or thought is explained. So, simple present tense actually describes a habitual action, a general truth, a future action that has a fixed schedule, a permanent situation and a feeling or thought. We are going to discuss present continuous tense. Here, present form also is there and continuity also is denoted. Well, present continuous tense is used to express an action plan for the future. For example, I am going to Europe next week. I am going. Here it is present continuous, but it is expressing an action which is planned for the future. Now, present continuous tense is also used to express an action that is going on at the time of speaking. I am speaking to you. The girls are dancing on the stage. So, are dancing. It's an action which is continuing at the time of speaking. Now, present continuous also describes an action that may or may not be happening at the time of speaking. For example, I am writing a novel these days. Now, here it is describing that I'm busy doing this action at present.